Right, hello. Uh, sorry for the music, playing Star Wars music, and I shouldn't be doing this while I'm talking about Klingon stuff. But fuck it, right. Uh, we don't mind, we're all one big sci fi family. So, welcome to Martin's uh, video review on his latest buys. Uh, right, this is what I bought today, uh, yesterday. Uh, Klingon Disruptor, as you can see by Diamond Select. Fucking love Diamond Select. Let's, let's go back. As you can see, that is lovely. Uh, can we get a closer look? I've got the other one. I should get it out really and display them both. Uh, right. This is the other one I've got. This is the other one with a different tip at the end. I could name it all, but I'd have to dig it all out, and I don't want to do that. I paid 28 quid for this. No, 29.99, sorry. Uh, yesterday, which I thought was quite cheap. I actually paid a lot more for the other one, a £10 more when they first come out. So Forbidden Planet got these yesterday. Uh, so, you know, this is it. Uh, it's you, uh, you get your Star Trek stuff at the back. Let me turn this down. You know, Star Wars moves it to Klingons, eh? Right, as you can see. Right, I've got all them uh, old, uh, Diamond Select Art Asylum. Love, the, love their stuff. I'm going to do a video comparing Playmate stuff uh, to the Diamond Select, which is going to be interesting, but I'll do that when everything's set up. Uh, as you can see, so that's everything. Fit of history on the back. Uh, brutal weapon for a brutal race. Klingon Disruptor is a Type 3 Disruptor weapon capable of exciting the molecular bonds in a target, resulting in tissue damage, living beings, and a painful death. This is actually a replica of the legendary sidearm, includes electronic light sound effects, mimic screen, used weapons. Uh, brilliant. Right, let's open this. Eh? Right. Right, do, do you keep the boxes? They're probably, uh, you know, I said this in my last video about boxes. God, I've got a whole storage cupboard which I could put all the stuff in, but it's just full of empty boxes. You know, because, you know, you get people who should keep the boxes, you know, if you ever sell it all. But I mean, I don't want to sell anything yet. Do you know what I mean? I've got a handful of fucking stuff. And at uh, this time in my life, I don't want to sell it. I enjoy sitting in it, looking at it, and sort of having it around me. You, do you know what I mean? You, you know, when you get into a whole collection thing of it all. Yeah, do you know what I mean? It's just it's great isn't it when you come in for a long day at work and stuff and you turn you turn all your lights on, the TV goes on, put a Blu-ray on, or put the PS4 on, whatever, put something and all you've got all your stuff in glass cabinets and, and you know you collect it, you really get you're really proud of it, it's art in it in a, in a crazy sort of way. Right, got more bloody adverts, that one meant to be uh, for an hour. Yeah, sorry about this. Right, here we go, Star Wars mix one hour, right. right. Sneak adverts in dot the YouTube. Right, so right, let's get this out. Right, hang on. Right, so right, nice and easy out of the box. Right, as you say, that's the box. It says something about uh, exclusive action figure express. Now, right, after looking at that, I don't know anything about that. Right, put that on the floor. Right, as you can see, it's here. Let's get this out. God, I do like this. You know, the size of it as well. I have got a thing on costume, you know, so and I've got several just up to oil. Right. Dread it, you know when the when the tiles stuff up there. Right, put that there. Right, here we go. It, it's basically like the other one. You know, you get right, that's the wires off. Sure. Right, let's go, as you can see. Right. Yeah, it makes the same noises. Right. Yeah. Lovely settings. Yeah, that's good. So, well, let's have a look at this. Batteries, standard going there. This, uh, that's just a bit bloody annoying this. Uh, this, I've just found it slides off a bit easy. You know, oh no, I don't, I'll just put it in. Right, so, you've got your trigger button there. Yeah, you've got your trigger button there. Uh, your three settings are here. You know, there. So, obviously, stun, kill, and destruct, or whatever. Go and throw it all. 
Uh, uh, this is, I mean, bloody size of it's great. Do you know what I mean? Make my fucking day. Do you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, love it. You get a you get a true feel of it. It's quite light though. I've got a uh, I've got a replica one. Don't make any noise. I wear it when I'm dressed as a Klingon. Cause it's really heavy. So when you got it on the holster, you feel feels quite weighed down. This is very light, which you no, know, which is good. It would be good if you could get one that's heavier, a lot heavier. Do you know you get that feel of what it would be. So yeah, this is love it. Brilliant. I think that's it really on the old Klingon uh, disruptor. So there you go, as you can see. So please uh, share, subscribe to videos. Uh, Martin's Global Appeal with one P. I had to do that for copyright reasons until I bought the digital domain name. Absolutely bloody annoying. Uh, so there you go. Like the design, similar, basically the same other one, just altered a bit. Uh, that's it, definitely worth £29.99, best 30 quid I've spent, reasonable, the last one was £10 more. So anyway, please share and subscribe to my videos, be great to talk to you, leave your comments, uh, you know, just love debating sci-fi and reviewing stuff, I know, I need to get a life. Right, so, there you go, right, kapla, live long and prosper, see you on the next video.